Sea monsters, being some of the most fierce and scariest enemies within Arcan Odyssey, forces us to be a little cautious and be wary of the sharks that can come out of the sea out of nowhere and bite you in the ass for 2,000 damage. No, I'm not kidding. But as of now, the only types of sea monsters we have in the game are sharks. And all these are sharks, tiger sharks, great white sharks, megalodons, lurkers, poison jaws, and wide eyes. Wide eyes being the one that does 2,000 damage. But either way, to an extent, all these sharks are pretty dangerous as they can do hundreds of damage no matter what. But this wasn't what I came here for today. I came to speculate and bring up some ideas of what we can expect to see in the upcoming updates of content for sea monsters. And since this game, unlike World of Magic, is very sea based there are plenty of sea based activities and plans for more activities down the line and i wanted to start this video off by talking about the kraken the kraken is already confirmed to be added within the game it's not here yet but it's definitely coming soon as on the trello's adjustment list vedex has a whole list of random features he wants to add that can come at any time and one of the main features that is on the high priority part of the list is add new sea monsters now it's almost guaranteed that we can see the kraken as being one of these new sea monsters that will be added as it also will be nice to see other sea monsters than just sharks and actually all the sea monsters within the game right now have droppables so it'd be really cool to see what their kraken could drop once you kill them and if i can remember correctly one cool thing that i remember when i was playing the game for the first time doing the storyline at sailor's lodge one of the npcs i talked to brought up the kraken in their dialogue so i can really confirm that vedex is putting a lot of focus into making this a new feature that we can see really soon now i could go on rambling naming a bunch of different tiers of certain sea monsters we may see but i'm I'm trying to focus on the big possibilities and the main types of sea monsters that could actually face as challenges to us within the Bronze Sea, the Dark Sea, and the Nimbus Sea. But sea monsters within the seas like the Nimbus Sea is really far-fetched as the Nimbus Sea isn't even going to come out until after the Dark Sea. So what about the Dark Sea? What could quite possibly be within the waters of the Dark Sea? Now I would like to start off by noting that the lore references a lot to mythology and from what I've seen and read about the AO lore I can tell there are a lot of characters from mythology kind of transferred over into AO. For example, like Poseidon and the Kraken. Poseidon is the god that unlocks your first awakening within Arcane Odyssey, and the Kraken is going to be a big ship swallowing sea creature. Now, both these are quite similar to their descriptions in mythology. So, one possibility and one idea I would like to bring to the table is the possibility of Leviathans. Now, the Leviathan is a sea serpent, but also in other games is a category of usually very large and deadly fish. So, taking these descriptions, it's likely that we can see some sort of leviathan within the dark sea as the dark sea is no friendly place insanity resides within the air dark deep rough waters storms all around and mysteries to be found so if there were to be any new big sea monster that would likely live within the dark sea the leviathan really does fit the description as leviathans in other games and mythology are humongous so realistically it would only make sense and it really does fit the description and i think that it could be quite possible for the sea monsters within the dark sea to have some things to do with the upcoming lost and ancient magics but that that's a different topic for a different video that i'll get into in the future but if there's something else you guys want me to go over or there's something you guys think i missed or should address and cover in a later video let me know down in the comment section below i know the list was very short but honestly from the trello and other sources of information we have other than from the lore we don't really have much information on other guaranteed sea monsters to appear within the game as of now but these two i listed could really play a massive part within the game as they aren't just some normal shark that would run up on you and bite you in the foot. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did and you haven't already, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I upload daily and I would really appreciate it. If you want to be notified for whenever I upload or do live streams, make sure to join my community discord. I also have a clan and if you're interested in joining that, make sure to join the discord on more information about that. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.